Merry, Merry Christmas! Christmas. <laughs> Yay! Christmas Woo. Starbucks! Woo! <laughs> it's morning and we're in the McDonald's drive-thru. I'm not too sure why. Yeah, I want a hash brown. Should I have one too? I think you should get whatever the hell you want. It's our six year anniversary also. That's why I'm vlogging. Oh. It's obviously not Christmas on the day we're filming. This is December 18th, our six year anniversary. But I know that I'm going to be uploading this on Christmas. So I just hope everyone has a wonderful day and a wonderful Christmas morning. Can I have an egg McMuffin? I've never ordered that. We got medicine balls. This cookie has a stuffy nose. Cookie girl. If you have like a little bit of a sickness, like a stuffy nose or a sore throat or a cough, go to Starbucks, get a medicine ball. It's two teas with honey in it. It's like the best. Thank you so much. Yeah. Mm. What's on it? It looks like it could be like a Canadian ham. Canadian <laughs> What? We have access to the world's best bacon, egg, and cheeses, and he gets an egg McMuffin from McDonald's. I'm going to give it a shot. What do I rate it? Let's see. Seven. I have a good rating. This hash brown gets like a, nine, a nine only because it's not hot. And I haven't gotten this in literally years. First, my McDonald's order was always, when I was little, chicken nuggets and french fries. Then, to a crispy chicken snack wrap with no oh, cheese. Yeah. Obviously, french fries with that. Then, I changed to just french fries and a hash brown because I got disgusted at everything else. And now, I don't get it at all. This needs like hot sauce or ketchup. Oh, I'm sorry. You should have asked for it. Should we go around again? No, no, no. no. We can't. If you're watching right now, comment what you got for Christmas this year. Like your favorite gift out of all of them. Yeah, 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 yeah. That. And comment your favorite gift that you gave to somebody else. <gasps> Such a good idea. Guys, I'm full of ideas. I think I know my favorite gift, but I can't say it yet. This is currently the setup. Hey, <laughs> my beautiful angel. We're watching Impractical Jokers, drinking our medicine balls, and I'm gonna take a shower and wash this hair because it's been a whole week since I have. Guys, we've literally been watching Impractical Jokers all day long. So, I'm doing my makeup and I asked Paul what he wanted me to do when he said something fleeky. So, what are we thinking? Like, a winged liner? Mm -hmm. Any all eyeshadow? Out. You need to go all out. I'm going all out. All out. It's a party on the face. Okay, so what eyeshadow? Um, six years. I'm seeing like, maybe like a gold. Are we cutting creases? Mm -hmm. Should no, I? Alright, we're cutting the motherfucking crease. Since we've been dating for six years, mm -hmm. What are six things you love about No, I was going to say six of your favorite memories that we have together, but that's like a lot. I can't choose. But you could just do six things that have to do with our relationship. What is, what is it? What are your favorite Going things? Going to dinner with you, being lazy. Like right now? When you come to work with me. Mm. I like to shop for you, your family, hanging here. Aww. And the final one is our sleepovers. Okay, agreed. For sure. And cooking together. Okay, I'll tell you mine. Number one is how you take care of me. Number two is definitely like going out to dinner and going on dates. Number three, you just make me laugh and I love laughing with you. Oh, and watching movies together and shows. Definitely our sleepovers. Number six is the fact that we have created well i love your family too the fact that we've created such a good friend group together mm. and like we have so much fun that's very true and special like we just meshed together our best friends and, and your sister yeah my sister she's yeah. my bestie the crease is cut like i did the cut crease she cut it up. and it looks fire i haven't done this in so long i'm doing it i'm like damn paul i forgot how good i am at this i left my hair natural because it's raining out i was gonna straighten it but then i was like definitely not gonna straighten it in the rain that's so stupid and i'm trying mm -hmm. to save my hair now i'm gonna pick out an outfit i don't know what i'm gonna wear i'll let you guys know when i'm done guys you have no it's idea it's five o'clock we went through and Brooke wait has been getting dressed since probably like since i spoke to you last yeah but they don't know when that was. when was that it was light out that's all i know it's been like two hours of Brooke trying to pick out an outfit. okay but i no, i no. knew i knew that i wasn't where i wanted to be and I wasn't gonna give up until I was where I needed to be. And we're here. I'm here and everything is fine and dandy. She looks fab. Thank you. We're ready to rock and roll. Yeah, so usually this happens all the time. Like, Brooke takes four hours to get ready and then I have like a nice 10 minute crunch time to get ready because we still have to drive to my house. And then now I have to get ready and then we have to go. And I already know what I'm wearing, so I'm not too worried about it. Picked it out a while ago. You, know you should have done that, Brooke. <laughs> Guys, we're on our way to dinner. We're in a neighborhood, it's called Huntington. They have the cutest town probably on 
all Long. of Long Island. And they have the most amazing stores. It's definitely the biggest town. And they do this little holiday strip on one of the streets. They close it down and it has a huge Christmas tree that I just showed you. And on that is like all shops and they have like little, like all decorations. And we would love to walk around after, but it's raining. So that's not really in our journey today. So cute and so Christmassy and I hope you're all just having a great Christmas. So we're going to a restaurant called Prime. It's a steakhouse, but they also have a bunch of other stuff. They have like seafood, sushi. It's a nice fine dining restaurant. Yeah, it's really, really, really nice in there. Paul's deciding what he's gonna eat for it takes me long him. to decide as it takes Brooke to get dressed. All right, actually I might take longer to get dressed. That's really saying something because he's been looking at the menu since I've been getting dressed. <laughs> <laughs> I literally have. So maybe we're even then. But I love him either way, so I don't care if it takes him long. We're gonna get this sesame potato bread with black truffle butter and sea salt. I'm gonna get the gnocchi with Parmesan white truffle sauce. And Paul's thinking about the Delmonico steak. What kind of steak is that? I have no idea. I don't know anything about any This cocktail menu has 77 pages. <laughs> this is intense. They actually have a really sick wine cellar here that I sat at for my 17th birthday. I would love to show you guys, but we're nowhere near that. Sparkling rosé, they really filled me up. Cheers! I love you. I love you. Six years ago. Ah! Another six more. Okay, this is the potato bread with truffle butter. the truffle bread. Now we have truffle fries and I'm getting truffle gnocchi. I did She's not gonna turn into a truffle. We did not. <laughs> At restaurants they never fry gnocchi like this but finally for once. It's fried the way I like it. This is a nice. I'm not a steak person, not really anymore, but um guys, we're in a women men bathroom right now. You can go to the bathroom. I guess, I don't know, together? I think that's their goal here. This is so know. fun. I, we saw women men, we're like, oh, perfect. Bro, like, can we hang in here for like 10 minutes? I'm like, what are you fucking doing? <laughs> it's cool. All right, guys, his full fit. Dumb clothes that I got him. Pants from who knows where. Thrifted Luhai crew neck, which is a Private Lutheran school. school on Long Island. And then- Some random <laughs> white college shirt. I feel like I'm going to Luhai like dressed in uniform. No, you look but great we, though. But I, I love it. Love the fit. I visioned this outfit like days ago. Okay, now we're going home because we're so stuffed that we literally told the waitress that something came up and we needed to leave because we wanted to get out of here immediately. <laughs> and it was too hot. We were in like the outside yeah. area. It but was, it was like an enclosed outside. Enclosed outside area where the heat was blasted. It was too much, was but we still enjoyed our food and had fun. Oh, the fresh air feels amazing. Really? Look at how cool the outside is though. For the entrance, you should say. It's very grand. And, and like when right you here. pull up, yeah, when you pull up, you see like how beautiful it is on the outside. Really and also that looks sick. The Harbor Club at Prime when you pull up because that lighting is cool. Guys, it's the end of Vlogmas officially. Yes. This is the last video. I appreciate every single one of you who've watched all 25 videos. And if you haven't, and you're just tuning into this video, click down below, there will be a Vlogmas playlist linked and you mm -hmm. can watch every single video I posted in the last 25 days. It's been a lot of hard work and I really enjoyed it. And it's gonna feel really nice to have a nice big fat break. Merry, Merry Christmas. I hope you guys are having slash had the best Christmas day ever. And don't forget, the best gifts don't come under the tree. Whoa. They're right here in front of you. Mm, love you. I love you. It's true. And yeah, I just love you so much. Mm -hmm. I really do. And I'm so thankful for you and all of you too. A round of applause for Brooke for all the hard work and dedication for the past 25 videos she just put out. It takes a lot of time and effort. Thank you, everybody. So, Thank you. I'm proud of myself. But anyway, we're going to watch some...
curb your enthusiasm and laugh a little bit. All right, guys. Merry Christmas. You guys are and the Happy best gifts in the world. Yes, and Happy New Year. I will see you after New Year's Day. Um, probably the second week into January. I'm going to take a bit of a break because I think I need it. But you can keep up with me on Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, TikTok. I'm, I'm all over the place. She's all over the map. In the meantime, the while map. I'm taking a little break. And also, you can binge my videos because I just posted 25. Okay, love you. Happy New Year. Peace out.